good people of the internet, and welcome to Vlogmas with me, Hexa, your host on this YouTube channel. I've never done Vlogmas before. I am high key scared shitless that I will crash, burn, die, and fail miserably and be forever embarrassed and ashamed of my great failure. But also, <laughs> I'm very excited and I think it's gonna be fun to do this and you know I'm just trying to challenge myself a little bit and you know um, show my intense commitment to this YouTube channel. So today is vlogmas day one. I am filming this a few days before the actual first of December because let's be honest I needed some uh, pre-planning some huh, some way to make this bearable for myself. I did some polls on Instagram and in the community tab to ask people if they prefer like daily vlogs or pre-filmed videos for vlogmas and most people do seem to prefer daily vlogs so I am gonna do some of those but I have to admit especially now with covid my daily life is not that exciting there's probably gonna be just like a lot of cute little clips little scenes from like our home life or family life my grandparents are here with us right now so there is a lot going on there's a lot of people everywhere and we are having quite a bit of fun but it's not something like super sensational and exciting i mean if it wasn't covid then maybe we would be going to museums or or doing like some fun stuff out and about together but this year i feel like it's just not the best year year for daily vlogging. Most people are staying home and not doing that much. But there will be some vlogs and then there's also going to be a lot of like pre-filmed like more planned structured videos on different like winter and Christmassy topics as well as a couple that are probably going to be just general like lifestyle type content or wellness or mental health stuff like the the content that I typically put out. There's gonna be stuff like winter skincare routines, lookbooks and like outfits for Christmas, makeup stuff, gift ideas, some DIYs, some decorating our house for Christmas. There's still a lot of stuff that's being figured out. I'm trying to make my vlogmas also like financially sustainable. I would love to do shop with me videos for Christmas, like go Christmas shopping with me, but as I have mentioned in previous videos, we get our presents from Santa, so I'm not really gonna be doing the Christmas shopping. Sorry to disappoint. If there's anything you guys wanna see more of in Vlogmas, leave all the comments, all the suggestions, ideas, desires, things that you want me to talk about for Vlogmas. I would love to hear what you guys think. And now let's get into to the actual vlog. Today I'm gonna be helping my mom build some furniture for her room. She is paying me 15 euros per set of drawers. Each one is taking me like three hours to build and uh, she says she is looking at it as financing her own gift. But I don't know why she'd say that because obviously her gifts are coming from Santa so I'll, I'll just keep the money, I guess, you know? I also, if I make the time for it, will be cleaning my own room because right now it is a mess. I still haven't finished unpacking since I was at my boyfriend's house and there's suitcases behind me and it's just not good. There's also like a, a hefty layer of dust all over everything. So let's get into the rest of my day and I hope you guys love Vlogmas and the things that I have coming up. I really, really hope that I make it through all the 24 or 25 days straight of uploads.
something seriously wrong here and I don't know what it is. I followed the instructions perfectly, but something is wrong. Let's compare to the other one. Okay, little wheel, gray wheel thingy on the bottom, and it says left on the left and right on the right. Oh no. Please, 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 please God, tell me I don't have to take this apart. Oh, this is not too much. This is wrong. This is definitely wrong. Something is wrong. Oh no. Wait. And the, this thing has to be on the top. And it's not. I put these upside down on both sides. I think I'm gonna have to redo it. Crap. Okay, hold on. Let's see. How do we fix this without taking the whole thing apart? Can we just uninstall these? Uh -huh. Maybe. Hold on. Let's see. Oops, uh, another way. Fuck. So, if I take this, if I take this, and put it this way, then it will look like that one. Okay, it's fine. It's I made a little bit of a mistake, but it's okay, it's fine. I don't have to take apart this heart or this part, which was the hardest part to build, so we're good. Whew, thank god. Okay. Okay. Whew, that was close. What? <laughs> Can I have a shot of whiskey? Neat. Baileys. Ugh. Do you think me being drunk will make this easier? No. Something went wrong. Something is wrong that these things are upside down. I have to... They're on the wrong side. I have to... It's fine. I, 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 if, if I had to take this apart, I would lose my mind. But this Those is fine. Is okay, no? This is fine. It's it's a little harder to put Mario. to put them in when they're like on like the, this, but it's I think it should work. I'm fine. No? I'm vlogging. Vlogmas is starting. This is the first episode of the Vlogmas is me going to Yes, yes, I'm gonna translate it in the subtitles for everyone. <laughs> um, what time did you say you wanted these done by? Tomorrow morning. Ugh, fine. Tomorrow morning I want to start organizing my stuff in them. Fine, then I'll, I'll, I'll start the, the next one today as well. Six, five. Five or six. Five. Yeah. Five dollars? Yeah. That's two and a half hours. Ah, okay. That, yeah, okay. Right? Yeah. We don't say sarmale when I know we don't have any. That is not fair. I thought in my in my dizzied state I thought there was actually sarmale. Can you please bring me water in my other green cup? I have one green cup for orange juice and another green cup for water. <laughs> in theory this should work now. So let's test the top one out and hope that it goes in. My pomodoro is going off. Yes. My boo. Thank you. My Pomodoro went off. Un pahar de vin? Mm-mm. Yeah. Bitch. I've been working on these for five hours at this point and I'm pretty sure I made the same mistake on this set as I made on the last set that I built. And it's an easy fix so it's not as bad as it could be but I'm really annoyed just because like I can't figure out where along the way I went wrong. The first one that I built yesterday my mom was like supervising so I don't know if like 
she prevented me from going wrong. I think what actually is is happening is just like there was a 50-50 chance that I would do it the wrong way around and um, so that's what happened. I'm frustrated that I made the same mistake twice and I don't know why I made the mistake. I know how to fix it, but I don't know why I made it. So that's annoying. Mom and grandma have just left and they won't tell me where. They're just, they, they went somewhere and they don't want me to know where. I don't know why. I'm low key hoping they went to Ikea to buy me Alex drawers because I've been talking about them for like months, but <laughs> I don't know. Ugh. Motherfucker. <sighs> Bitch. No, still no. Okay, there. Time to clean my room. of boxes I have to put in the attic because sometimes I sell stuff on Depop and then I like to just have these boxes to ship stuff in. I have one from Zalando and one from Parish and one from Sephora, but the Sephora one has my new Inky List skincare stuff in there and I wanted to do a photo shoot like I wanted to take some photos of the skincare stuff for Instagram but I don't know if I want to take the photos with the boxes or without the boxes so I have to keep the boxes until I decide and I don't have <laughs> a place to keep the boxes I actually don't really have a place to keep the products either so <laughs> it's a little bit of a problem maybe maybe I can put my skincare stuff on this shelf like there that could work that could be cute. I should probably just take the photos with the boxes and without the boxes and then toss the boxes as soon as possible because I mean like it's so annoying keeping skincare products in boxes because then like you know you're like your hands are wet when you need to open the next thing and it's you have to take it out of the box whole thing. <sighs> Moving on suitcases. Every time I go over to my boyfriend's house I bring like a million suitcases because I have a lot of stuff to do and I need a lot of m materials and equipment to do the stuff that I want to do and <laughs> every single time it's just ridiculous because it's like three suitcases and a ring light and a camera bag and all sorts of stuff so it's <laughs> it's a little annoying. I'm a little annoying. <laughs>
is sad. I've only had it for like a week. I watered it, but it's not happy. The soil isn't dry. Maybe it's a little dry. I don't know, I'll give it more water. Perk up little guy. Or girl. I don't want to kill more plants. My bed sheets aren't where they're supposed to be. I don't understand where they are. Hmm. Bona, mi ai pus tu undeva așternuturile de pat? No idea. Not here. Not here. Not in my closet. Oh god. I just found a bug under the bed. That's not good. And I'm freaked out. What the heck? So I found one pillowcase. These are sheets, but they're not the sheets I normally use. And the blanket cover just is not here. What on earth? Bed sheets don't just disappear. This is really annoying. So I just checked my mom's under the bed storage and found my not only my bed sheets, but also a bunch of my favorite clothes that are just randomly stored under her bed. So I don't know who did that, but seriously, I'll, I'll bring it all out. T-shirt, workout shorts, t-shirt, kimono, not really a kimono, but something like that. Let's say robe, pajama bottoms, t-shirt, shorts, bunch of my socks, a pair of underwear, and my bed sheets. I wanna speak to the manager. This is ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna go put all that stuff away now. <laughs> pillow cover I've used a lot versus the pillow cover I haven't used a lot. That's sad. I think I need new bed sheets. <laughs> the blanket looks fine though, which is weird because it's been washed just as much as the pillow cover, so I don't know what's up with that. I mean, it's more faded than the, the other pillow cover, but it's not as faded as the... You know what I mean. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 